What's going on, everybody? We are here <laughs> at Talladega in the freaking uh, IndyCar. Um, I'm sure you've probably watched a bunch of other YouTubers already do this this week. Ooh. Me and Austin Missler, armed for gaming, are out here. He's the number 15 car. I'm the 17. Um, yeah, me and him decided to run this together. I don't know if we're really going to be able to work together all too much in this. Because um, we might qualify separately, you know, and maybe never see each other. But we got 45 laps worth of racing, so... Hopefully we can work together in at some capacity in the race, <clears throat> but we're getting ready for uh, qualifying here. Let's go ahead and just get out there and do it. I didn't recognize any other name out here in the in the field with us today. Got a freaking fly flying around. Uh, for the main event though, this ball will be invisible. That the, we, I will not have that going once we're actual in the actual race itself. The old bar that's in the middle of the screen. So just pretend that's not there right now. <laughs> It'll be gone once we get racing. But for qualifying in these uh, Indy cars, first lap will be against the wall, against the fence, whole way around. And then we'll come back second time by white flag lap running the bottom. Um, it is a fixed setup race, so everyone's on the same equipment for qualifying. I'm fairly certain there might be some little things you can change, but I don't really know if it's enough to you know, go way faster in qualifying or not. And the trial was a bit scary too, because all the way down low is not fast for some reason, it seems like. I really don't know. So we'll have to learn that, but I think qualifying is going to be really close together. Throw a blanket over the whole entire field, how close everyone's going to be here. But hopefully Austin and I can survive. It's Like I said, it's going to be 45 laps of this garbage. I don't know how this is going to go. we got a whole week's worth of super speedway racing. I don't really know what day I'm going to be uploading this on. But here we go. We're getting the quote-unquote green flag now. Let's lay down a freaking fast lap. Let's bring it down. I don't need to bring it down too low and touch the apron. Not what I want to do. Bring it out to about here, I think down the back stretch. Hold the tires as straight as I can. And just easy with the steering. Making very minute adjustments. Zero mistakes. Don't bring it all the way down. Oh, we're bringing it all the way down, I guess. And boom. 39.8. So far, that is pole. I don't know how long that'll stay because we were like the first guy to roll on out. But hopefully that freaking stays. That's freaking awesome. Um, might be scary though, starting pole. That might not be a good idea. Maybe maybe not everyone really qualified. That might be a strat also to just not qualify. Yeah, look at that. <laughs> Almost no one's qualified. It's just me and Austin. <laughs> wow, that's scary. Okay, maybe we shouldn't have qualified then. I don't know what we're going to end up doing in this. Uh, it's going to be me and Austin side by side, though, possibly. Got about another two minutes of qualifying, but let's go ahead and get to the main event. 45 laps and uh, see, uh, yeah, what we can do. All right, we're on the back stretch. I am scared. We're driving a freaking toothpick no, <laughs> here at Talladega. We also have Austin Missler you know, right behind us. Everywhere. He's in a Jeff Gordon um, Indy car right uh, on our tail no, here. No, that was being legitimate. Never got some guys on the mic. We've got William Price well. around us. Max, yes, Maxime Paquette. Jeff Murray. Yeah, the yeah, we said Austin you. Missler. He's right behind us. 45 laps. Um, I'm probably going to be quiet for a while. Yeah, I'll second that. Uh, this is going to be super scary. Um, well, I got some practice running ARCA in Atlanta earlier, so, you know, I figured... Fellow ARCA guy running at Atlanta. The whole top lane, oh, for man. some reason, behind yeah, us is gone. But, yeah, we are gonna we got 25 laps worth of fuel, so we will need to pit. Um, hopefully, there's going to be a caution so we can pit under yellow and don't well, have to do that under green. That would suck. I mean, oh, it's, it's the and, uh, yeah, I'm getting right, ready to go green you. here. <laughs> this is going to be uh, monumental. <laughs> I don't really know if we need tires or not, so I don't know, but anyway, here we go. Don't want to accidentally rear-end anybody. Just take it easy, like I said, we're in some, you're gonna get some huge runs. You we're in some you know, toothpicks. To make it five wide or anything. Oof. Big checkup on the bottom lane for some reason. Sorry, Austin. 
We're going even slower. Here we go. Let's go. Come on. Let's go. That was a really slow start. Really sketchy. But we're green. Let's go ahead and take it easy. We got a little Red Bull in front of us. I know Red Bull cars are kind of scary. Let's get my foot off the brake. And my senses are heightened. My senses are heightened. My hair is in my face. It's in my way. Got a fat run right there. It's a good lift. Right on the inside. Got Austin behind us, just chilling with us. I don't want to go to the outside, because if there is a wreck, the outside will die. And uh, we're stuck in sixth gear. Don't want to get too fat of a run. And I just want to hug the inside for a good while. We don't need to be going for position or anything like that for a good while. Um, I feel pretty confident with being able to just slam on the brakes, too, with Austin behind us. Probably just dive out, get out of his lane, and slam on the brakes if needed. But I'm glad we can, we're racing with Austin. I'm glad he's up here with us. <laughs> Keep an eye on him and hang out with him. Armed for gaming. If you want to see his perspective of the race, go look him up on YouTube, fellow YouTube guy. I'd imagine you're probably already subscribed to him. I feel like we uh, share some of the same viewers. Good guy. Yeah, we're two laps in, and I've said like a thousand words already. But it's looking good. We're just single filed on the bottom. I'm cool with that. Keeping the tires going good. And uh, we're being fairly fuel efficient too, staying on the bottom like this. Fuel might come into a big play. But currently, we actually do still have our tires set to uh, change them out. Might want to change that at some point. Don't really know if we'll need them or not. If it feels tight, you know, obviously later on we might do it. I just, I don't know. There goes for a pass. Slingshot around him. Fairly easy. That was rather impressive. Well, Antonio here. We might do the same thing. No, I don't want to do it. I don't want to pass him. I thought about it, but... Whoa! Jesus! He freaking slowed up a ton going in that corner. Wow! That was very close to death right there. I don't know why he slowed up so much. They scared the hell out of me. Austin's following us, which is cool. Let's go ahead and just chill out now. Slide back into line. Austin right behind us. Hell yeah. Hopefully it can be like the both of us at the end of the race, just like this. Massive lift. Massive lift. Inside line, massively slow. Just trying to stay up with the front pack and save fuel. It's crazy that we're like hitting the chip. You'd think maybe they would have some different gear in here. crazy. We get like a huge run down these straights and I think that's what's happening at the end of the straight is just this massive lift. <laughs> but alright, I've calmed down. <laughs> it's like a Sunday drive now. Really not too much to worry about for a good while. Break out my mouse. Try to. Come on, mouse. Where the heck you at? There you are. Jesus. Sorry, Austin. Oh my god, dude. He was probably like, what the hell's going on there? I had to change my tires really quick. I maybe not too good of an idea to do that under green. But that was bad. Sorry about that, Austin. I was uh changing my tires there for a second. Make sure he understands. Point 
that we're in the boring part of the race, which is okay. It's like a game of chess. That's what super speedway racing is. Just a big game of chess. And this is actually um, Austin's first race, even in the Dolora IR18. He actually just bought the car for this race. So, <laughs> first race he gets to do in these is a freaking super speedway race. Which is insane. Oh, we got someone going for a pass on us. Go ahead and hold the inside for him. Let him by. He's got the fat run. Lift. I wonder what Austin's doing with this throttle. It seems like my strategy is just like I'm just flooring it and then all the way off the throttle. It might be more efficient just to like hold it at like, you know, 75-80% or so. Woof! Might be being a little too aggressive with the throttle. Good. I almost thought that was Trace Shock name in front of us. Guy we used to race in the big blocks quite often. Old Trace Shock, but it's Trace Shadid. Three. Cool last name. Shadid. Shadid. Ooh. Oh, <laughs> got some other language going on. Oh my god. We're over 10 laps in. We've got about 35 laps to go here in the race. We've got 21 laps left of fuel. I'm sure you guys can't even see that. The black box is probably covering it. So I'll try to keep you guys updated with uh, what fuel consumption we're looking at. pretty amazing how it's just single filed out you know these guys are, are fairly smart you know I'm liking this they're not going hard as F like on the start and even guys way behind us like, this is a pretty pretty big field pretty big pack of cars out here go single file for a good ways and we're getting these fat runs so I mean at any point someone can just fly by like the whole field and lead it if they really wanted to Like, every single car in this field can get up to the lead right now, if they wanted to. Got another car looking to maybe pass. It's Talon. He said something funny before we took the green. I don't know if that was it was included in the video, but I was on the mic saying, everyone take it easy, be calm. Talon said no. <laughs> so I was like, okay. Everyone gets to be easy besides Talon. Talon can go hard. So that might be what he's doing. Talon Smith. Comes another guy for, for pass here. <sighs> Scary getting down on that bottom, bottom lane. So we're going to go back, back down another position. Puts us in 14th. I think at one point we were, were in like 11th. A couple guys have just gone on by. Using that top lane. Absolutely mobbing. Looking at 18 laps of fuel. You know, I know, know there's like a weight jacker you can change in this car, but I don't really think it would matter here because we're not getting tight or anything, at least yet. You know, I was... Looking forward to this race, because, you know, I'm, I'm like a dirt guy, I'm dirt Gavin, because uh, it wasn't going to be so stressful, you know, dirt is so much throttle control and mind power, I was thinking this was just going to be so easy, but so far this has just been throttle control, dude, like, come on. <sighs> I knew it was going to be like, you know, obviously having to lift a little bit for the runs you get, but not like this, dude. 
This is a job. This throttle control is a job. Kevin Burrell here in front of us. Hopefully it'll be like between me and Austin at the end. It'll be like either he gets the spot or I get the spot. Gotta go side by side. Hopefully it stays clean too. Because anything can happen. You know, I mean... I'm not gonna like purposely dump Austin, but you never god dang know. I, I'm kind of an idiot. Oh, he's getting loose. Oh, guy got shooting on the outside. It's Talon. What's up, Talon? Whoa, he's also in a... Uh, Jeff Gordon paint scheme. He made it squeeze in right here. He's probably just saying hello because we had that banter before the race. Thank you very much, Talon. Looking good. Taking it real easy. I think we should be in the 15th spot now. It's probably the same paint scheme I think that Austin Missler behind us has armed for gaming. Try to back off from the front pack just a tad. Don't need to be right on him. But he definitely wanted to hop up in front of us, which is cool. Being nice and easy with a throttle. I'm gonna go ahead and lead, lay my head back a bit and just try to conserve my energy here for the final stint that we'll end up getting. There goes Talon for another slingshot. I want to wait until we're looking good on a fuel run to pit or to, to be making these slingshot moves. Oh, I thought I saw smoke. But, but yeah, if we if we end up not making the finish of this race, I'll be okay. We're I'm gonna stay in this session as long as Austin is alive. So if we wreck out, we'll go ahead and watch Austin's perspective. Whoa, that was intense. Wow, did that guy use up his fuel already? There's no way. Unless he's like on some sort of fuel strategy. Yeah, we got, we got 12 laps to our name still. I'm looking to uh, use all 12 of those laps, and then we will be good for fuel. Oof, Austin behind us. That was a massive lift there. Oh, wow. I'm an idiot. I just realized the freaking, the bar down the middle of the screen still there, <laughs> like 20 laps into the race. I forgot to turn it off. Man, I'm stupid. But it's all good. We can still see. It's crazy that those guys are pitting. I don't know. Maybe we need to pit soon. I think maybe in a couple more laps. We can go dive in the pits. Is that the leader saying they're going to be pitting in? Is this whole front pack just about to dive in the pits? They do. I'm going to hit the pits next time by. Number 17 car here. Gavin Ropchan hit the pits next time by. Woo! Hopefully that tells Austin to hit the pits. Yep. We're going to hit the pits. Hopefully all is good. We're not going to get tires. We're just going to be getting fuel. I did not practice a pit stop, so I don't know. These guys might be on the same situation. My heart's pumping. What are we going to do here? What are we going to do? Woo! We nailed that. We nailed that, man. That was nailed. Caution? No! 
I don't know if that's bad or yeah, what. Are we going to be a lap down now? Right after that caution bell. Five. I don't know if we're going to be a lap down or what happens. Come on, fuel, 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 fuel. Go, man, go, go, man, go. Hopefully we don't go lap down. I really don't know how this works. I think we might be okay. Yeah, we didn't get passed by the leader. And we're looking all good. We're going to have to let the two car by. Don't really know where that is. Might end up putting us a lap down. I don't know, man. We'll see. We'll see. Right on. I appreciate it. Just uh, be careful, Austin, on this freaking restart. Just careful with me. Yeah, I got gotcha. you. <laughs> all right. So you heard that. You got to be careful with me because uh, I'm on some old tires. Austin did go in and get a full set of tires once that caution came out. He quickly switched it and it's got the four uh, tires, something I probably should have done. But... We're up in the top six, top ten now, up here with the big boys. We've got 20 laps to go. And, uh, yeah, we're going to maybe start going hard, maybe. But, yeah, I'm on older tires. Like I said, I'm going to have to take this restart really easy. I might end up dying right here. Here in five seconds, I might be dead. But well, I'm going to take it easy. And uh, we're going to just try to bring this thing home. Austin's right behind us. Time, and uh, here we go. Jesus Christ. Jesus Christ, dude. This is so stressful. Come on. Just go, leader. Just go. Alright, easy on the throttle on the start. Thank you, Austin, for giving me some breathing room. Unless there was a wreck already. I know the restarts are going to be scary, but let's go ahead and get to the bottom. And then just uh, not even try to pass. Let's just roll the bottom right behind these guys. My heart is racing fast <laughs> for some reason. We've still got a long ways to go, but we're good on fuel now. No more pits needed unless uh, we wreck. Cars on our outside flying already. Let's try to keep it up with this front group on the bottom. Don't need to try to pass them or anything, but let's keep it up with these guys. Clear, 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 clear. Outside. Yeah, we're going hard now. I can feel it. Still a mega lift from the fat run we got. Yeah, things are getting sketchy. We might not want to be up in here with all this. Jesus. We might want to back off this. This looks scary as hell. <laughs> We're quickly being put back outside the top 10, which is totally fine by me. I don't expect this to be clean. Everyone's flying by us. This is insane. <laughs> I'm, I ain't going up there in that. Not this early. Once we got like five to go, if they're still going hard, then yeah, we'll go up there and try to join them. My screen just like glitched. Hopefully everything's all good. Here goes Austin trying to get by us. He's going to try to go for position. Good luck to you, Austin, my man. We're going to try to play it a little bit safe. Maybe. Maybe we can follow him a little bit. I don't really know. I don't want to lose the whole pack. And I don't want to lose Austin either. Looking sketchy. They look sketchy up there. Got Austin up on our outside. Still got him right on our outside. Keeping an eye on the four three wide madness up ahead. Got my eyes like a freaking eagle. Yeah, I don't really know if I want to go on that high line with Austin, man. It's scary up there. If there's a wreck, everyone washes up the track. But, oh man, we're sending our best luck over there to Austin. So we're just taking it easy, just waiting for the big one. Still have an eye on Austin up there. Oh, there was some big contact there in the front. That's probably what he's saying sheesh about. But we got 15 to go that time by that car we just saw go down on the apron for a split second.
cars behind us have fallen back. They're probably a bit worried about what may happen up here. Don't blame them, but it gives me some room to lay on the brakes if needed. I think we're in a good spot, though, kind of just watching these guys here in the uh, 15th spot as the number 17 car. There goes a guy. He's going to try to rejoin, and they're going to wreck. Oh my god. Wow, it's still green. It's still green. And uh, that dispersed everyone. Whoa, when you're inside, outside, I mean. I think we went by Austin. I think Austin lifted and got way out of it there. Okay, someone got to clip that shit and send it to iRacing. That was huge. <laughs> right on, where are we at? Where are we at? We're in 11th. Okay. <sighs> All right. Um, I don't know where Austin went. He might have fallen off real hard from that. There was a big lift. We're going to have multiple packs now. Thank God we're up in this front pack. Thank God. Thank God we were prepared for this, dude. We were prepared like just for that. Caution, I don't know what does anymore. All right. We got this pack here. I guess let's chill with this pack. Maybe, maybe back off a little bit. They're wrecking up ahead. Oh, my God. Dang God. They're wrecking more. There's the caution. Holy god dang. <laughs> Woo! Let's get a restart. We're going to have freaking 10 laps to go under that on this restart. Wow. Oh my god. All right. We're coming out of four here. Probably hopefully for the final restart. Probably not. Um, we're going to have 38 laps completed out of 45 once we do take the green. Um, Austin is in the ninth spot currently. Uh, we're in the sixth spot. So Austin is within uh, drafting distance. He'll be able to get right up to us. Uh, this restart, of course, is going to be a bit sketchy because I'm still on some fairly old tires. Why are we slowing down so much? Why do this? This is just grouping everyone up, man. God, I hate it when the leaders freaking do this crap. But anyway, <laughs> pardon my uh, complaining, but we're getting ready to go green. Less than 10 to go inside the top six. Let's go. Take it easy. Ooh. Almost had the dive below that guy, but we would have got a black flag. And we're going to have someone go on our inside. Massive bummer. Hate that that had to happen. Hopefully we can get a fat draft, though. We got some contact. Jesus, dude. Still on my inside. Dang it, man. I wanted to get to the inside line. But I guess we're going to go hard. We got Austin right behind us, I believe. Following us on the outside line. And we're up in the front with about seven to go. Let's just take it easy up here. We should be okay. I'm not going to try to make it any three wide moves. I just want to get a top five, baby. Let's just hang out right here for a good moment. Don't need anyone making any gnarly moves. We're going to be three wide car on the outside, it looks like. Not what we needed. Not what we needed at all. Hopefully that guy knows how to hold a line. Hopefully they know how to hold a line. I'm going to start shutting up now. My heart can't handle this. This is freaking crazy. Got the outside line coming by once more. Three wide. Woo! Woo! Golly! The amount of stress is unbelievable. I know it looks like I'm just straight faced and everything's probably just totally fine. Like it's really calm just watching the video, but all the emotions I'm freaking feeling right now. Holy crap. Free wide. I just want to finish right here. I don't need to win. I just want to finish right where we're at.
All right, we're looking good up here, guys. Let's try to hold this. No one uh, make any dumb moves up in this top pack. We're looking beautiful. Hopefully, I don't end up making a dumb move after that one. <laughs> Just got to remind everyone, I'm that a-hole. Yeah, it's just like rental go-karts. <laughs> that is exactly right. I don't know where Austin Missler went. He's back there behind us somewhere. Just really focused on holding this line. Just holding this line. Connor outside needs to hold their line good. Just... Follow the white lines on the track. Hold the line. My hands hurt from gripping the wheel tighter than I've gripped anything. And I honestly feel like I'm like about to freaking throw up. Because this is wild. And I'm just using the throttle. I mean, I'm probably an inch off this guy's freaking bumper. Not trying to make it three wide. Not trying to make it three wide on him. Oh, getting real tight. Two to go. Next time by will be the white. It's just like any other lap. We don't need to be the hero this race. All right, my shoulder itches really badly. Thought about turning right, getting in front of that guy. Thought about it. White flag. When we take the checkered, it's going to be crazy because we're all going to have to slow down. Oh my god, my heart. Oh my god, my heart. Let's just keep her good, keep her clean. No one needs to make any dumb moves. We're gonna finish the race. Come on, baby, let's just finish this race, baby. Doesn't matter where we end up, doesn't matter. Woo! Woo! On the brakes, baby! Big wreck after that! I knew a big wreck was gonna happen! Woo! 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 Yeah, everybody, man! That was a finish! Woo! There's Austin Missler, took a 12th. Woo! <laughs> I wanted to hop up on the mic. Woo! Woo! That was awesome, boys. That was awesome. Good finish. Woo! <laughs> I freaking screaming. Yeah, that was pretty awesome. Man, me and Austin, dude. Austin Missler. Yeah, baby. Yeah, baby. Oh, do the burnout. Oh, single handed. Oh, yeah, baby. What's up, Austin? We made it, man. We did it, man. Woo! Yeah. <laughs> Oops, I dunked him. Got an 8X. Hopefully, all those X's don't count. <laughs> but I don't, I don't really mind. My freaking safety rating is superb. Think we should be totally fine but man that was absolutely awesome shout out to austin man what a great race what a great race those x's might end up counting i don't know i kind of feel bad now but Whew. unbelievable man unbelievable here's lap 17 let's go ahead and watch the wrecks see uh see if anything big really even happened out there here's a 15 car looks like they're returning back onto the race track and they lose control Hopefully not in front of the field. No, thank God. Yeah, they were smart and just aimed it downwards again to not be in front of the field. That was like a willpower at Indy move right there. Here's Insane Racing. Check up into the wall. Got thrown up there. Can't even really tell what's going on. There's us in the orange. Slap 29 here. Looks like they're going four wide up front. A little bit of door banging. Nothing too monumental happened there. Ooh, ooh. That was sketchy. Golly, these things are freaking mobbing. I can't believe we took home a top 10. So happy. 
so awesome. See what happens here. Oh, he gets shoved down low hard. I remember seeing that happen way in the back. Then he shoves him back up the track and a big wreck happens. Let's see what happens here. So he gets shoved down low, comes back up the track, shoots up the track, shoves that guy up high. Wrecks the whole field. There was no caution for this wreck, by the way. Some other people might get collected up in there. I think that might be... Aust no, that's not Austin in the 11. My bad. Uh, oh, he gets dumped! I think that's what causes the final caution. Eventually. Possibly. He's all sorts of messed up. Oh! Oh man, there was a car. I think we were in that. Yeah, we were that orange car that just went really high right there. We got lucky dodging that, man. That was huge. Got that guy coming back in through the pits. Here's some more action. Yeah, that's Austin right there now in the 15. That is Austin Missler, Armed for Gaming. Look at him back there. He's right behind us. He's looking under. We were in a huge monumental move. That guy got thrown on the inside and killed. I don't think a caution came out for that one. And then that's at the line right there. Big massive wreck. And I think Austin might have survived it. I really am not 100% sure. And uh, yeah, big old massive wreck. Everyone, everyone dies. Let's go to us and uh, watch the wreck from like us. <laughs> From my, uh, let's go to TV3. And then let's, let's see this massive wreck unfold right here. Coming to the line, look at that. Crazy. And it just had to be a monumental wreck. Holy moly, that's gonna be the thumbnail. <laughs> that is gonna be the thumbnail of the wreck right at the checker. That guy is straight barrel rolling. <laughs> oh my god. Oh, what a, what a race, man. What a race. Did we get any DMs from anybody? No, everyone hates me. Round of applause to everyone. Let's go take a look at the results, see if we did end up getting an 8x, because uh, we, you know, we're getting all those contacts at the end, but let's go take a look. I can't even believe we actually finished that race. Um, I haven't even looked yet to see if we got an 8x or anything, but I just want to say, man, that was actually way better than what I thought, man. That was awesome. Freaking, if you were in that race and you're watching this, good job, dude. Good job to you. Uh, how many even splits were there in this one? Holy moly, there was five splits. How many cars were there? 24 cars. Jesus. So, uh, completed all 45 laps. There was two cautions. So it did six total caution laps. It was a 3,572 strength of field. Uh, Freddy Yuto Garcia comes home with the win. Uh, fastest lap time goes to uh, Yario Maragato. Very good, very good. We do only finish with a 4X, so we're good on that uh, part. Uh, we gained 51 I rating. That's what we needed to see. We got 3,185. Um, Austin Missler, so we finished 8th as a 17 car. Austin Missler comes home in the 12th spot um, as a 15 car. Does gain some I rating, gets 16. Looks good. Uh, he actually finished with a 0x, so he managed to dodge that freaking last wreck somehow. <laughs> so good job to Austin. That's freaking gnarly. That last wreck was huge, man. That was, oh, what a great race. That was a, such a great race. Thanks for watching if you ended up watching this whole thing i have no idea but um if you did that's insane and uh yeah leave a like on it i had a blast and uh you guys have a good one goodbye